boy Kip J. And your girl Sophie. Yeah! Oh. All right, we're going into My Hero Academia, episode number 71 and 72. It's going down. It came up to this point. We officially got the warrant. They're going in. Now, with that being said, the Hasakai group, right? The yes. eight bullets. Just need to clarify that. It's not literally the eight bullets. You know how, like, let's say League of Villains, mm -hmm. and they'll call them the... <laughs> the special ops. Yeah, the thing, special right? ops. There you go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so they're like the special ops of the group. So that's what the eight bullets are. Oh. So if you kind of, like, break it down, so the eight bullets is going against, going against well, we have the big three, uh -huh. plus we have Froppy, Uraraka, Red, Laeto. That's already, like, seven or something, and the other pros. And Midoriya. Yeah, Midoriya. Duh. Duh. Midoriya. Yeah, but we're going to be seeing, like, I guess we're going to, like, each episode as it goes, we'll see, like, a spotlight of each hero fighting one of the, the special ops. Sun Eater of the Big Three. Oh, I oh. guess we're going to be seeing sun, uh, the Big Three fight first. Yeah. Uh, nothing wrong with that. No. Remember, he ate swordfish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he ate swordfish. What? Let's see How's what that? this going to do. What is this? No. It's either that or tough skin. Tough skin. Ah, does tough sword, skin? Does tor swordfish have tough skin or like the razor? Maybe yeah, they have that. Knife. Yeah. yeah, maybe it's just for him to stab. Yeah, probably from his arm or something. Right? Yeah. But <laughs> it's better than tuna, right? <laughs> <laughs> but alright guys, thank you guys so much for joining Kimchi and Tofu. Tofu, are you ready? I'm ready, are you ready? Let's go! Oh, Tamaki, look at him. Oh, as a kid. He was so shy. Well, I mean, he's still shy, but he's still he's... like that. Yeah, he was always like that. Ah! Wow! <laughs> so cute! Holy cow! So it's Mirio that became his friend first? Yeah, I would think so, because Mirio's that type of kid, you know? Aww. You would think Mirio's like that ever since he was a little kid. <laughs> it kind of looks like Calvin and Hobbes. Calvin? <laughs> wow. Oh, wow, that looks so cool. Yeah, look at Mirio shining so much. Yeah, so Mirio. He, he looks up to Mirio. Yeah, Lemillion's his light. Yeah. Yeah. Watching from his back, you know? Wow. It's so funny because his face hasn't changed. It's just his body got buffer. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> Damn, look at this. Wow. <laughs> Please calm down. Boom. <laughs> oh my god. Man, what does he have? What is that thing? I don't know. It's so weird seeing a racer head like teaming up with them. Yeah, right? Yeah, I like it. Well, that's because he's your favorite character. You just <laughs> want to see him more in action. Mm. <laughs> Whoa, oh my wow. gosh. Wow, wow. It's like a ninja resident. <laughs> Who's it? Oh, is it the first? Oh, oh okay. I thought it was going to be one of the eight bullets. Oh, damn. Whoa. Wow! So the arms is centipede too. Everything centipede. <laughs> she just threw, blew a freaking bubble in his eye. Okay, now they're underground. Yup, they're right here now. Okay, now next. What? what? From his own hair? Oh, wow. Oh, so that's why he can go through the wall. And he can keep his clothes on. Yeah, because if he doesn't, then his he'll be naked. <laughs> oh, they're gonna just all break through at once. Hell yeah. Ha! Letting the kids do the work. Oh, oh. oh it's the little guy. Oh, okay, he's Whoa. not little anymore. <laughs> Shoot, what the hell? Oh! Whoa! What? what the heck? What the... Wow. Mimic? Oh, so Whoa. you can get in the object and control them. That's why they probably made the stage uh, underground like this for him, too. So it's like fighting on his home ground. Wow, this is a crazy quirk. Yeah. How are they going to be able to find this guy? Tamaki's the sun eater. The video oh. already knows how he's thinking, huh? Yeah. Oh my god, he's just going for it. Come on, Tamaki. Come on, you ate a swordfish. Let's go. Go, too. <gasps> Whoa! Oh. This is OP, dude. Yeah, it is. <laughs> what the heck? That guy's like Scarecrow. 
Um, I don't know what the other guys are. Yeah. Oh, so Tamaki's gonna go now. He had a ponytail. Ah, wow. there's always Tamaki. Yeah, it's wow. him to shine right now. Ah, so oh, these guys are eight bullets. Yeah, eight bullets. I don't know, these guys don't look that strong. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Oh, erase! <laughs> <laughs> I can't use it. <laughs> oh, yeah, they just said that's like Aries quirk. Yeah. So that confirms it. Oh, here we go. What? Oh, wow. So he already knows everything about him. <laughs> so they ate a lot of uh, takoyaki. A lot of octopus. Lobster, too. Oh, yeah, the lobster. I want to see the swordfish. Wow, look at him taking the control, taking the lead. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Oh, he's gonna try too hard to help, so help him. Hurry. Yeah, knock him out. Huh? Oh. What? He used his beak? Oh, yeah, he did. Oh, what? Oh, he had a, he had a oh. sword in his mouth? Yeah. Oh, no, the... The corks came out. Yeah, it's, it's like an ice guy. They already wore off. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, damn, oh. even his eye. Holy cow. Oh, my gosh. Oh, even plants. When he eats vegetables? Anything he eats. Oh, oh yeah, that's right, because Media when he first started. He had a hard time too. Yeah. So he's very determined even though people laughed at him. That's, that's how that's how he got this strong. <laughs> you know? Mm. So it's not only Tamaki that feels like that about Medio. Medio feels like that too. Wow, so you see, mm. like rivals. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. wait, that's... What is that? He's it's a rock sun eater. Oh, shell. So it's like a shell and on top of the octopus oh, tentacles. So he did the lobster and octopus combined. Variable size is manifesting several at once. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Vast hybrid. Chimera cry. <laughs> wow. No. Tap it. Wake up. It's time uh -oh. to eat. What the hell does that mean? What? Did he just... Fight him? Yeah. <gasps> oh no! Oh no, so he counters him probably. And That's death. what swordfish is for, right? Oh, you think so? Wow, look at him, he's so fast! Oh, oh no. shoot. Oh no. Oh no. That's, oh my god, that guy's crazy. Huh? Oh! He's, he's too low. He took it, yeah. Oh man, he's done. Well, no, we haven't seen a swordfish yet, though. <gasps> Damn. So overhaul saved them. Yep. Oh wow. Oh. Oh. oh that's right, he got his eyes so he can't see anymore. Oh. Uh oh. No 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 no. Oh he ate the crystal! What? Even crystals? Yeah, I ate anything! anything. Try 
try and eat that. Yeah, try, yeah, right? <laughs> try yeah. to eat that one. <laughs> I, I just thought it was only food, but it's any material. I guess. Wow. Damn, look at all this glitters falling down. Wow. Wow. The manifest is literally anything. Yeah, you. I ah. guess, yeah, you can eat anything. As long as he digests it or eats it, right. he can produce it. Okay, because I, I always thought it was only food or, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah but it's... Well, but then we never thought he would try to eat anything <laughs> other <laughs> than food either. That's right, that's right. Because it literally says whatever he eats. Whatever, yeah. But we just never thought about anything outside of food. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because like, what, what else would he eat, right? Yeah. Well, so... I always thought that Tamaki was more of a... When we first saw the big three, I thought that, you know, we had the, the backstory of Medio that he was the one that worked really hard for it because he didn't know how to really use his quirk. Yes. But also, it wasn't only him, but Tamaki as well. I thought Tamaki was a genius in the beginning. Like, he was just very talented. Both looked at each other as somebody that they looked up to that was right. the light or, you know... Whatever that, so they looked at each other. Uh, Mirio was able to talk to Tamaki and be able to tell him that, you know, I look at you as a rival, somebody I can compete with. Yeah. And that's why I look up to you. And so he's like, if I'm the sun, then you're bigger than that. You're the sun eater. Yeah, it was the so sun that, eater. Not, yes. the, not like the shadow, but like, no. or the moon. You're the sun eater. Yes. Well, uh, they are a little bit similar, but not really. Because no. Mirio, he, he was trying yes. and he couldn't. Oh, sorry. He was trying, but he couldn't get to the point where, where he is right now. Well, well he, he is, but yeah. I think with Tamaki, he had the skills. He, he, he was a technically a genius, I guess, and somewhat, right? He but just didn't have the confidence. He just didn't have the confidence like Medio. So they both were lacking in something, yes. and they both fulfilled each other with yes. something that they were lacking. That's yeah. why. Wow. I, I didn't really think that that's how it all started, but... Me either. Man, speaking Medio, little Medio. Oh, it's so <laughs> cute. And his suit is made out of his hair. Yeah. That's why he probably had that ponytail, because he's growing it out to build the suit. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because yeah. that was before he got the suit. So mm -hmm. he, that's why he cut his hair now. Because, oh, okay, yeah. now I see why he had the ponytail before. Probably. Yeah. I, I'm just guessing. No, that's probably... Come on, then where else is he going to get right? his hair? Like his armpit hair, <laughs> <laughs> you know? Anything. Any hair, right? Yeah. That's true. <laughs> but they're kids, so I don't know. I think the on, main yeah. hair is up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's his, his suit is made out of his hair. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> now when I see him, I, I always thought it was like tights or something. Yeah. It's like, ah, it's his hair. <laughs> it's his hair, yeah. Wow. How does that look? Like, ah. <laughs> I don't know, but I mean, that's really cool that they're able to make that. Right? Okay, so now we just got against the three, you know of the eight bullets, which they were actually not bad. Yeah, they were actually pretty good as a team. Team, yeah, because if they fought solo, then nah. But I think those three, they're like the <laughs> Team 7, Inashiko, Ch Cho. They, they've just always been working together. That, oh. You know, their teamwork, that's why their teamwork is like that. Oh. Yeah, but we haven't seen the swordfish yet, too. No, we didn't. Yeah, yeah I thought he was going to pull that out or use that, but I, he didn't. I'm surprised his teeth didn't crack from taking a bite of the crystal. I know, he must have just swallowed it. I don't know whose teeth is stronger, Tamaki or the other guys. Oh yeah, <laughs> right? Yeah. Wow, his abs are ripped. Yeah, remember? No! Oh, no. no! What happened? Oh, oh. what? Remember, he's saying my face or something. Remember, cause that guy freaking ripped out, ripped out the shell off his face, right? Oh. So it's, I, I saw like his skin's probably ripped off with it too. That's why he has like a lot of scabs on over here. Uh, yeah. he, this, this is Kirishima's episode, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's so into it. <laughs> Dude, if I was in that room, I'd start throwing up. I'd get so dizzy. Right? Me too. Oh! oh whoa. He ran! Yeah. Oh, 
so no. after the boss got sick, these guys, these guys don't even like Overhaul. No. They're just scared of him. It's only the eight bullets that really love him, but not these guys. Yeah, not the real. Has she always had her pants unzipped like that? Oh. <laughs> I didn't notice till now. Oh, oh erase her head. <gasps> oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Back home. No, but back home should be fine. Yeah, yeah look at him. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Dang, now he's the one separated from the group. No. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Is <laughs> oh, he jumped in to say Aizawa too. Oh. Wow. So who are these two again? Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh, so they're going against a fighter. Holy cow. Whoa. Wow. Oh my god, even Fat Gum's like getting hurt. Oh. Oh! oh! What? So this guy is super strong, not yeah. just strong. He, uh, Kirishima's hardening. I wonder if that's like his skin peeling off or something. Right? What is this? He's he has a, a barrier? barrier? <laughs> oh. Uh-oh, who's this guy, too? I feel like we're going against, like, martial arts now or some sort of... Yeah. So it's like the monk. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, I don't know what the other guy does. Some type of priest. You say priest? <laughs> what? I don't know. He <laughs> said priest. Sorry. Wrong Support thing. like a Support, healer. Yeah. <laughs> ah, so he's more like he is the not like barrier. A, yeah, the barrier guy. Oh yeah, you are right. It is like. That's crazy how Fat Gum already knows what to say to him. Uh huh. Because probably Fatcom's gone through this too. <laughs> what? Is he a. What? <laughs> He's a. Fighting him? Oh wow, he called him Overjerk too. Yeah. Wow. Arrogant. He only joined this so he can he can beat up people. Yeah. Oh, oh dude. His, already his, falling off. his belly's coming out now. Look at the way he covers his eye. It switches, right? Yeah, one must be... To let go of it and the other side to bring the barrier. Probably. Back Ooh. on! Oh, oh my god! Oh. Please don't die, Fakum! Oh my... Dad, this guy's fast for a freaking big guy. What the hell? Oh, shoot. Red right unbreakable. Oh, no. A little teddy bear. Is that him? Yeah, that's Kirishima. <laughs> Whoa, Crimson Riot. Crimson Riot. So that's who he looks up to. Oh, it's Asido. <laughs> She's getting mad at them right away. <laughs> what is she doing? What? <laughs> They're friends. Yeah. <laughs> what? She, oh, she gets along with people so good that <laughs> she can even make him do break dance and become friends. <laughs> oh <my gosh. laughs> so, Kirishima and Acid, Acid went to the same school. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. Whoa, that guy. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this guy is scary. Man, seeing more Kirishima, he really is a lot like Midorima, uh, Midoriya, huh? Yeah. Oh, whoa, oh, Asido. Oh, she's here too. <laughs> that's it, he just wanted directions. <laughs> He's just too strong, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> that was so scary. Yeah. Uh, oh, she sent him to the police. <laughs> oh, she lied, and then yeah. she oh my, she gave the direction. To yeah. <laughs> Dude, oh, poor Kirishima dog. Yeah. He <laughs> oh, he's talking about uh, Deku. 
の命をかけて動かなきゃいけないと来て一歩踏み出せる人間がヒーローになれるんだ初めて個性の発言した時うっかり目を切ってしまったそうだ個性で胸張って命をかけたヒーローんん昔誕生日に送ったもの大事にヒーローそ、so、now he's knowing it's okay to be fearful. Yeah, it's okay to be scared. Yeah. And that's how he said, you know what? I'm going to UA. Yes. Yeah. Oh, and now he's practicing hard. Yeah. And him getting accepted. <laughs> She's like, wait. Oh, because well, of his yeah, hair. That's right. Why didn't I know? Oh, you noticed that, right? Yeah. Oh, dude. That's right. His hair color changed. That's why I asked him, like, that's him? Yeah, that's why you asked if it was him. Yeah. Because I was like, man, this guy is a spitting image of Tamaki before. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh. oh, wait, it's been absorbed this whole time. In one punch? Oh. It's all in the punch? Oh my god, look at it, dude. Oh, oh. 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 oh he's coming oh, in. Yeah. He's being the shield. Oh my god. Oh! 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 Nice! First, the oh. barrier. That's all fat comedian! Oh! oh. 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 He's, oh he's, fat. he's not fat anymore! <gasps> he's. <laughs> I kind of teared up. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of teared up because I was so happy for freaking Kirishima. Did you? Yeah, I, oh, I was happy for dude, him, but I didn't tear up. No. Dude, I felt the tears coming out because I was just like, I was so happy for this guy. Wow, I'm starting to really like him. Me too. Kirishima. I'm also liking Fat Gum. Fat Gum too. Dude, that was, holy shoot, dude. So. Yeah. Not only can he be one extreme, he can be another. So he absorbs everything. And into his fats. And he burned the energy. That's why his fat burned. Yeah, that's why he's like handsome and no, he's cute, but he's handsome now and he has like a nice body and Yeah. <laughs> he burned all the energy, burned all the fats to give him back that punch. Yeah, so he was absorbing this whole time and Kirishima came in time and did his job. Yes. Oh, even if I didn't see like Red Riot Unbreakable go in like berserk mode. Just him doing that one part and showing the backstory of Kirishima, that was just enough for me, man. Ma yeah, wow. me too, because it just shows that he was able to step in as a hero and just give it his all, even though he's scared. Yeah, I really, really like this uh, backstory of Kirishima because it doesn't really just show like all these students just coming in the UA. It really shows like how they got there. Yeah. Because we only saw that with like Midoriya, right? Deku, because yeah. like he wanted to get into UA, he was quirkless, but seeing other students yes. go through the same thing and he's almost like Midoriya Deku but the difference between him and Deku is that Kirishima wants this, to do the same thing as Deku but the difference is Deku acts on it yes he just goes yes yeah whereas Kirishima has been having a tough time being able to act on it because he freezes in the moment exactly but now he was able to step it up and thank God Fat Gum was able to hold off yeah. like just in time. After seeing this backstory, now when I look at like Aoyama yeah. and, and Minata, uh, how, the, how the hell did they get into Yeah. How the hell did they get into UA, dude? No, obviously, you know, Minata's just gonna be a bunch of pervy posters <laughs> and just dreaming about it. That's how he gets in. Yeah, He's but just you can't practicing just so he can see the woman. <laughs> so my angel. Minata. <laughs> in his case, he's been sweating. He's been working sweat and blood just for the girls. Yeah, it's just for the girls. It's not to be a hero. It's for the girls.
<laughs> Can you imagine like his backstory where he's just cheering like, I want to see the boobs so bad, but I can't. And then there's like another hero that's like Kim, and then it shows the screen. Ah, I was never scared of. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> that's why when I see that, I'm just like, dude. How the hell did those two get in here in class 1A2? <laughs> yeah, I wonder too. I wonder. <laughs> Not even the lower class, but the top one. But we got to see Ashiro's yeah. backstory too that's and how she got in. Yeah, that's so funny. She's so good with people. <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's very good with people. She made them break dance and then become friends yeah. afterwards. Yeah. And the, the beef was done. Yeah. And then the, the other person was just asking for directions, right? Yeah. yeah. And then she sent them the wrong way, but she was able to step in. Yeah. And so they were both in um, the same school. Yeah, before getting yeah. into UA. Oh, dude. Wow. Ooh, I wasn't expecting this. Like, Me you know. Either. I really like the fact that even when we saw Tamaki uh, on these last two episodes, you know how we were talking about like, th these guys are going to get their own spotlight going against uh, the eight bullets, right? Yes. I really like the fact that they go back into the past. Yeah, they're giving us their past so that we know why they're acting the way they are. And then when the moment hits that they oh. try to be, they, they actually become a hero. That's when it impacts the most. Yes, oh. they make it a really big impact. Yeah. And I also like who they're pairing them up against too, because it pairs up so nicely. Yup, yup. It's like, not like, mm -hmm. uh, like uh, I didn't like them or any of that. Like, I actually like the pairings. Hold on. Also, at the same time, we're talking about pairing because Kirishima jumped in with Fatgum to yeah. save Aizawa, right? Yes. In that moment, he acted right away on his own. He did. Right? He did, but it wasn't like a life or death. That's right, because on the other one, he got pushed back and he's like... He was scared because he thought his quirk was done. He's like, wow, they already tore me apart. Uh, there's nothing I can do. Yep, that's and right. And then that's where it's like, you know what? No, just keep going. Just keep doing it. Just like Fatcom says, the only time you lose is when you lose the will to fight. And that's the thing you have to do is make the other person lose the will to fight. Whereas... When he was saving Aizawa, he wasn't even thinking about any of those. He was like, he's like Deku. Um, yeah, almost, kind almost of. Almost, kind of. Kind of, yes. Yeah, similar but not. Yeah, similar but not. But like, I, I like this guy so much now, dude. Yeah, no, it, I, I like Fat Gum. You like Fat Gum now? I like Fat Gum because he, he says a lot of wise things. And he's a very good teacher, especially uh -huh. in the moment and in the time. Uh. Whereas... I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, he's just very good with talking to them and then also just being smart about how to do things. I think it's because you just didn't expect it from Fat Gum. No, I was actually already thinking that. Oh, really? Yeah, I was already like, man, I'm liking what he's saying. Like, he's still holding off even though, you know, right, he could right. die. Right. And just like all of that. And then, I mean, that's the cherry on top, you, the fat ah. on, but... I mean, That's true. <laughs> the fat blonde, yeah. But no, I I mean, yeah, I know. It works for him too it's, because like you yep. want somebody that can be nice and soft and squishy and then also can get ripped at the same time. Exactly. Yeah, dude. Right? Damn. That's like your perfect man. Yeah, best of both worlds. Best of both worlds. That's right.